Yo, yo, greetings, my lovely, beautiful star beings, pack of the world and the universe and all around, wherever, wherever, wherever. Um, today is Tuesday, uh, the 7th, voting day. So, uh, I just come across something, I had to get it out here and I've been meaning to put it out there. Um, first of all, whatever you, uh, read, see, hear, or f no matter who the fuck says it, if I say it, you know, don't believe nothing, man. Don't believe fucking nothing. But if it agrees with your own, like, reasoning and your own life experiences and, you know, if it, if it agrees with your heart, then go with it, right? Just go, go along with the flow. So, um, uh, a few weeks ago, this is how far behind I am because uh, I'm having like camera and uploading issues and they want to charge me for all this nonsense. Like my phone bill was crazy because of uploading. So, uh, I could be using that money to buy a camera, but I don't know what kind of camera to get and all this nonsense because it's all kind of fucking reviews and all this fucking shit. So whatever. I was uh, doing altar and my altar rituals in the morning. I fucking get together with my crew and meditate and uh, and I do my Reiki principles every day. And one of the Reiki principles is they are uh, principles that bring in happiness for the day because happiness is the miraculous cure to all diseases. And they're, I'll just, you can, they're not a secret, so it's not a secret. You can look online and look at the principles, and they, they go just for today. So they go, just for today, I will let go of anger. And just for today, I will let go of worry. Just for today, I'll give thanks for my many blessings. Just for today, I will be do my work honestly. Just for today, I will be kind to my neighbors and every living thing. So as I'm saying this, I'm like, I'm one to just be in the moment, right? And I thought, wow. And I just said, just for this moment, um, we will har I will harm none. I will harm to none, or something like that. I got it written down here in my little journal. My little fucking crazy. So, uh, let's see. I was like, wow, I could just make my own fucking principles up. So, the principles I'm about to read to you helps you to live in the moment. Okay, because I thought about this. I'm like, okay, so if I'm living, if I, if I just think, think of today, right? I'm not, I'm not about, today is kind of a future thing, right? Like, today could be 6 o'clock this afternoon while it's noon or whatever. Well, why would I want to be worried about 6 o'clock this afternoon, you know? Like, to me, it's, today is today, not, not this moment, right? So I said, just for this moment, I will harm to none. But then I thought, well, I is an ego thing. There is no I. It's we. It is we. Okay? Whether it's you and you in there or your spirit guides and your animals, whatever. It's all we. Okay? It's a we program. So this is kind of like a rough draft. But hey. I figure y'all, we all need this to help you live in this moment, because that's all there is, all we know, and all that will ever be. But everything is happening at this moment. Just f okay. Number one. Now the principles, Reiki principles, is four. I came up with nine. First, I came up with uh, six. I was like, I need to have nine, because nine is the number of completion. So, 
just for this moment, number one, we harm to none. Two. Just for this moment, we spark imagination. Three. Just for this moment, we are one. Four. Just for this moment, we fear nothing. No fear. Five. Just for this moment, we flow in this moment. Number six, just for this moment, we dance. Number seven, just for this moment, we sing. Number eight, just for this moment, we play. And number nine, just for this moment, we create. Just for this moment. That's all there is. So I was like, wow, I had to write all this shit down. Because I read a lot of quotes and a lot of stuff and I get a lot of stuff about imagination. You know, imagination is everything. If you really, really look around, just sit sit in a park and, or just sit somewhere in a, in a town or a city or wherever the fuck and just look around. Look at a stop sign. Somebody imagine this stop sign, right? And look at the vehicles. Somebody imagine this shit. Okay, but the whole the whole idea now in in the society or whatever the fuck, and through going through institutions of school and fucking church and all these fucking institutions, they want to drain your imagination, suck it right out of you, so you cannot think and have an imagination. That's what it's coming down to. So what I've noticed, like, just in my family, like. Imagination is gone. Like, it's totally drained and sucked out of the life. They just... Because you, they tell it's bad. You can't you can't imagine it. It's just your imagination. Well, no, that's how it fucking should be, man. It's how we fucking grow and evolve and create shit. They don't want you creating anything. But they want you to have five fucking jobs and fucking don't have enough time to eat. Can't even have enough money to buy good, healthy food. You gotta go eat GMO and fucking non-garbage at fucking... McDonald's or whatever the fuck that shit is, man. Garbage. Garbage. Our bodies aren't meant to eat any of that shit, man. None of that shit. Our bodies are really meant to eat insects and shit and fucking whatever's right here. Watch the animals. I don't know. What about this shit, man? How about I come up with some weird shit? How about this? Ego is its own entity. The heart is its own entity. The stomach is its own entity. The chakras are their own entity. The penis is its own fucking entity, right? Think about it. Am I here to to force any belief on anybody? Am I here to force nothing on you? But just think about it. I'm here to make people think and look into things and research I've noticed that with a lot of people, like, they carry this fucking fancy phone around with them, and I go, but you don't have time to research anything. Well, no, so-and-so said, so-and-so said, that's what so-and-so said, so so-and-so believes in that. Why do you believe in what so-and-so said if you don't, if it's got nothing to do with you or doesn't even resonate with you? Why? Research it. Well, I don't know. I, right. I, that's what they do. I don't, I don't know fucking understand that shit. Use the tools that were given to you. This internet is one. YouTube is another one. It's an outlet. That's all I'm saying. You know what I mean? So, wow. I come up with this crazy stuff, but it's not crazy. It's crazy, but it is because it's true. <laughs> ah. Yeah, so every, every thought... Every thought that you can think of, um, write it down. Write it fuck down. Keep writing stuff that follows your, I mean, that sparks your curiosity. Or, you know, why am I interested in these kind of things? Or why, why am I curious about this? Write this shit down. So you, it's easy to go to and refer. 
you know, it might not be all formal and right, all precise and in, in some kind of order, but reorder it as you go along. It's like a book of shadows, but it's just a, that's the whole eclectic thing, man. We're not traditional people. We take bits and pieces of every fucking thing out there and use it to our advantage. I'm not a traditional person. I, I don't. That's the beauty of anxiety. <laughs> wow. Well, that is. Yeah, just look and just. I mean, just look around. Like, okay, here, here's something else I heard that that uh, kind of sparked my uh, uh, imagination. Okay, how about this? Every answer that you seek is inside of you, right? The key is to combine imagination with meditation, right? Creation begins in silence. I love it. So, it's just all these things, man. And, and you got to say, why am I curious about these things? You know, like, when I started my awakening, like, I was, like, fucked up. I, I fucked up awakening, but, uh, just, just an example, like, I was wondering why, okay, why do I like these certain songs? So, so, so I took a look at some Black Sabbath songs that I just love, like, why do they speak to me, right? They speak to me. So I never really read lyrics or nothing. I just like, yeah, fucking jamming and shit. You know what I mean? But I could just hear he was singing about fucked up shit. So it wasn't until like a few years ago I was like, well, I'm going to start looking up all these songs and read every fucking lyric. Wouldn't you know, all those fucking songs were speaking to me. Like, hey, man, this is what's up. This is what's up, man. This is evil, and this is good, right? That's what I get. The mind is an evil thing, but you can't let it control you because it'll destroy you. So, I don't know, man. This shit's wild and crazy, but uh, things speak to you, so you should listen. Man is here. We're all, we're all here to help each other. There's signs are everywhere. That's why man put them everywhere. To help everyone. And everything is here for a fucking reason. So find out what that reason is. And just research shit. Go through your curiosity. Just go follow it. Follow it. And the more we play and you know, all this shit. The more things are easiest to come to us. Because we're too busy fucking playing. And we start noticing a lot of shit. Like wow. Oh wow. Cool. You know what I mean? It's just. It's some good stuff man. So. On that happy note, I'm going to go through this fucking journal and see what else I can come up with and come out with something else. So, um, I bought a new Oracle deck yesterday. I, I don't know why. I just keep buying these fucking tarot Oracle decks. I'm just fascinated with this whole thing. Anyway, there's a reason why I'm fascinated with it because... I love working with the animals and nature and spirit guides and all this fancy stuff. Now I'm on the fairies because fairies are coming to me and I got one that hangs out with me. So that's a lot to do, man. It's a, it's a, it keeps you off the negative stuff. It keeps you away from feeding in the negativity. That's another thing. When you're on like social media like Twitter or fucking Facebook and you see something negative and you respond to it, you feed it. You're feeding it. Don't feed it, man. Just don't even, don't even let it bother you. But <laughs> laugh it off, and it goes away. Because when you feed it, it, it controls. It, it just fuck that shit. Don't even feed it. But uh, I am going to get out of here and uh, chop up some leaves here. Yeah, it's a big one. I don't even know if you've seen that, but fuck it, right? This is what I got to do to chop up leaves. I can't wait till the shit's over. I want to spend more time at the center and uh, just do my work because I'm here to help everybody, whoever's seeking help, I'm here. So 
on that happy note, I love you all. Get a hold of me. Anything, anything, anything. I don't care what the fuck it is. You can call me, message me, fucking whatever. Be real, be you, follow your curiosity. I don't give a fuck. And I will write the principles down in the description. I don't even know what the name of this video is going to be because it's the way it is. So I love you guys also very much. I thank you for tuning in. And make sure to go to my healing channel and check out what's going on. I love you all and be real. Be you. Just you.